So I think when I first moved down here, um, I did. So one of the one of the clients I currently have, I've been working with since uh, since 2015. And he has been totally understanding of the internet uh, problems. And it's been it's been all it's been a great, great working relationship. One of the clients that I had when I moved down here, they were they were fairly stressed with the internet issues. Um, I got a lot of pressure from them to like move to the city and and try mm-hmm. to find somewhere that had better internet. And um, I think that one of the one of the benefits of consulting for so many years is it becomes really easy to know the red flags and be aware of the questions that could cause friction after a contract sign and um, avoid that. So, you know, one of the things that I, I like, I'm very open with and upfront with clients when I talk to them, um, even though I do have great internet, I mean, there's power outages here. I mean, some, you know, like there's, there's, there's plenty of things that are out of control in a way that may maybe wouldn't be out of control in the States. And so I'm very upfront with clients and I let them know like, hey, I don't always have great internet. You know, sometimes we may not be able to connect via video. Sometimes we may not be able to connect at all. Um, so I give them, I lay out those expectations. Um, but then I kind of go a step further now and I'm like, hey, I may be out two hours a day going on a hike or I may be out two hours a day surfing. Uh, just so there's an expectation of that not always on, always available. Um, at, so that's just not an expectation. And so living here has helped really identify like what, what client, what my clients need to know to, to feel that they can always contact me. But more than like, more than all of that, you, I just have to do really freaking awesome work all the time. And then my location's never an issue. Like yeah. that's really the secret. I think so many people come to Costa Rica and they, they ask me, how do you make it work? Like, how do you get clients? How do you, how do you stay here? And I mean, us getting clients, Fortunately, I have a great network in Atlanta that has just worked through referrals since I moved down here. So that has been a blessing. But getting keeping clients is just doing awesome work. And if you do awesome work, no matter where you are, the client really isn't going to care about your location. 